Go. All right. So um, I'm not too sure about a lot of these things. This wasn't a very good injection, so we're going to just try. Uh, first off, I think this is the uh, ventral abdominal vein. I'm pretty sure about that one. We know that one. <laughs> um, then after that, yeah. we have the uh, pelvic veins, which is where they used the ventral abdominal vein used to connect to this before it was cut. So these two are the, uh, the pelvic veins. Um, let's see what other veins we have. Um, a frog does not have a superior inferior vena cava. It is a anterior and posterior vena cava. This is the posterior vena cava. The anterior vena cava attaches somewhere underneath here. Um, this is called the sinus venosus, also the heart for most normal people, um, ventricle, and the right atrium, the left atrium. Also, there are aortic arches that come out of this right here and here. Um, the top one um, is the carotid artery. The carotid artery can be told by the carotid body, which does a lot of different functions in the body, but right here, it's a little bit rounder than the rest of the artery. So that's different. Um, then we also have something that, we also have one of the bodies that runs to the lungs. This is the pulmocutaneous. The pulmocutaneous also splits off somewhere and goes to the skin. Um, from there we also have the systemic arch which goes backwards and then it goes back into the frog and then from there it creates, it re reforms in the middle and then creates the, it goes into the renal portal arteries which are somewhere around here. So they curve back underneath all of this stuff back here and then it goes here, here, then it goes to the our, it goes to the uh, kidneys, and from there it goes on down to the legs. Now inside the legs, somewhere around here, you're going to have the um, the common. Here we go. These are the common iliac arteries right here. These run down to the legs down here somewhere. It's going to run and it goes to this side. And from here we have the uh, femoral, femoral artery. The femoral artery is pretty easy. It runs by the femur. Um, then also the sciatic artery. The sciatic ar artery runs in between the uh, gracilis major and the semimembranosus, which is going to be somewhere deep inside of this tissue. Um, from there we also have the uh, tibial, the tibial vein, and then there's the peroneal vein, which is excuse me, the peroneal artery, rather, and the peroneal vein, which is going to be, the peroneal vein runs through the peroneus, this muscle, and then there's the tibial vein runs next to the tibia, if I can find it, right here. Pretty small, pretty small thing. Never mind it. Yeah, right there. Okay. Um... As far as veins go, um, here's the uh, posterior vena cava, and it also has several different areas where it connects to the kidney, the renal portal veins, it, and from there it filters the blood, you know. It goes goes on down. What else do we have? Um, we have the... Um, let's see what else we have. I think... I think that's decent. Yeah, that's good. Okay.